Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be painting with my balls. Wait, what? You can't be painting with your balls? Well, why not? Because this is YouTube, not Xtube. It's inappropriate. Ah, uh, I see. Ah, oh, it's kind of ruined my video then. Hmm, what to do? Well, unfortunately, or fortunately, whichever way you look at it, I will not be teabagging any canvases today, but instead I'll be using these to do a painting with. Just regular rubber balls across the canvas. And we'll see what happens. Wait till the end to see the finished painting. Okay, and that's all done. Hopefully you enjoyed watching me create a painting with my balls. Technically, I didn't lie. It was a really fun, messy, exciting thing to do. It was really different to how I normally paint because I had very little control over what I was actually doing. And it's come out a lot different to anything I usually do as well, which is quite interesting. But I've got the painting behind us in the studio and I'll show you that now. Right, I'm going to have to step really back so you can see it, it's quite large. There we go. 
And the only issue I kind of have with it is I'm not sure which way it's actually supposed to go. Um, so I'll have to figure that out. And I'm not sure whether I should put some varnish over the top of it either. I'll get, try and get some close-up detail on it. Kind of see it there. But it was really fun. It was a really fun little experiment to do. So hopefully you enjoyed that video. I have painted with some unusual materials before. I know in my first year of uni, I ended up painting with a mop for some reason, which was challenging but interesting. Let me know down in the comments if you use any weird techniques to paint, if you use any unusual materials in your processes. It's always um, interesting to know. And give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It really helps out. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.